Okay. While meditating, I start noting the rising and falling like you teach. But when I completely follow noting the mind, I usually never go back to the noting rising and falling during the 10 to 20 minute meditation. Do I have to force my way back at some point? Um, well, no, but I think what you do have to consider is whether you are uh, prompting. This is a common problem for meditators um, that, that, that makes us prescribe a specific technique of returning to the rising and falling every time you finish noting something. So you make a kind of a conscious decision whether or not you'll actually be able to carry it out to return to the rising and falling. If you're not able to, if there's more uh, experiences to be noted, then you can note them. There's no, there's no need, absolutely you shouldn't force your way back. But the problem is that some people actually prompt the next one. They'll, in a sense, they're asking the question, what, what else? Um, what's there? They're they're actually uh, looking to find something, as opposed to simply responding to something that is distracting them uh, from the stomach, from the rising and falling. So you should look at it that way. If if it's not distracting you from the rising and falling, or the only reason you would acknowledge it is if it's distracted you, if it's already captured your attention, you shouldn't be hopping from one experience to another um, in the sense of, of looking for the next one. To avoid this, after some, after you've acknowledged uh, thinking, thinking, your, your, your next move should be to return to the rising and falling. The only reason you wouldn't is if you were in a sense interrupted uh, noting thinking, thinking by pain, for, for example, or by an emotion, for example. If something else catches your attention while you are in the, mid, in, in the process of acknowledging the thought or, or, or the experience. Otherwise, the prompting will lead to increased distraction, increased restlessness. It's not actually um, conducive to insight, it's certainly not inclusive to um, concentration which is an important part of the practice. So, no forcing, but um, intentional returning whenever possible, just to keep yourself focused and keep yourself from, from prompting, from, from jumping intentionally.